I missed out on so much. <laughs> no! <laughs> Hi you guys and welcome to the Shan Caravan. In today's video we're back with more Pippa Mario and the Thousand Year Door. We're traveling the world in search for the seven crystal stars to open the Thousand Year Door so that we can save the world. In our search for star number six, we have boarded the Excess Express en route for Poshley Heights. Although there seems to be a slew of mysteries upon this train. After solving all the mysteries and defeating the giant monster that tried to eat the train, we finally arrived in Poshley Heights to search Search for the crystal star. Sorry, I'm exploring for funsies. Oh. oh, I'm glad I came this way. I wonder if we'll hit on her. Bonjour, Monsieur Mustache. The last at the reception desk is très magnifique. I shall stay here every night until that art is mine. I shall not tire. Oh. Will he say the same if I have Goombella? Bonjour, ma. Oh, still. Wow, Goombella, you have been downgraded for for Susie Q over here. Welcome, sir. This is the Royal Poshley Park Tower. We promise a comfortable stay in the lap of luxury, the pinnacle of poshness. A room for the night costs a mere 30 coins. This is cheaper than the pasta. And I'm, I bet you anything, it recovers everything. I don't want to waste any more money. If I hadn't have done the pasta, I would definitely stay there, y'all. Maybe on my way out. Bruh. It may not look like it, but I get pretty stressed out, like really bad, eh? But walking barefoot on the grass like this makes me feel much better, you betcha. Care to join me, guy? That's weird. <laughs> it was weird enough that you were, um... You're walking around barefoot, <laughs> but you want me to join you? This is public property. I don't know what's been happening in that grass. People ask me if I get tired of walking the same route every day. And I say, no way, Jose, because it's just a bit different every day, you know? I'm not the same as I was yesterday. Neither are you. Even the town changes. And you'll never see another day just like today. So treat each day like it is. You need to Maybe this is supposed to be like California. <laughs> Sorry to anyone watching in California. You know y'all are weird. <laughs> hey there, Poshley Heights. It's sure nice and warm, eh? Yeah, I really dig it here. Cold places make me sneeze. Why are there so many penguins living here? Poshley Sanctum is a rather famous building, eh? And the painting inside isn't the only gorgeous thing. So is the building. I could just stare at it all day, you betcha. Ooh. Shine get. Hey, hey, hey. I think there's one in um, Blitzville that has a similar. Gone Traveling, Sanctum Manager. <laughs> no way, this is super weak. What do we do? Ah, it is my dear Luigi. What are you doing at my doorstep, young fellow? Your doorstep. What? You live here? So you're the Sanctum Manager? I totally thought you were a detective. Well, yes. That is more like a hobby of mine. If the truth must be told. But enough chatter. Hmm. Shall we go inside? Yeah, I can tell it's a hobby. You ain't no, uh, no, no super sleuth. Oh. <laughs> You're one step too late. We have the crystal star. Well. Ah. <laughs> you can't teleport. <laughs> hey, don't leave without me. I love how he already broke in the window. <laughs> oh no, we're too late. We gotta go after them. Just a second there, Luigi. Exactly. What is going on here? Speak quickly. 
<laughs> that was very quick. Mm, yes, quite rudimentary. So, you are looking for the crystal star in this sanctum? <laughs> yes, very interesting. Well, no cause for worry. The crystal star is safe. Yes, quite safe indeed. The stone that your rude friend stole was fortunately a red herring. A fake. The real one is hidden somewhere in the sanctum to prevent such a theft. However, as to the location of the real crystal star... Well, as Sancta Manager, I am, of course, prohibited from telling anyone. However, I do know where it is of that. You can be most certain. Yes, indeed. Besides, I'm sure a junior detective like yourself could find it on your own. Now, Luigi, put to use all the razor-sharp sleuthing skills I have taught you. Make me proud. Oh, don't you worry. I'm actually doing my best to finish Paper Mario so that I can start playing some mystery games for you guys. Uh, got a little star action going on here. Uh, I did... Ooh, okay, I can't make it that way. I did a little poll on... Um, bruh, how do I get back? Do I have to do this again? Bruh. <laughs> But I did a poll on my channel um, for like what the first mystery game should be. I had, uh, I believe, Ace Attorney, Later Alligator, Duck Detective, and the Dark Side Detective. And I was very surprised by like what you guys said. Uh, I was thinking maybe Ace Attorney just because the Miles Edgeworth games are coming out soon this year. But like... I know there's no way I could possibly make it through all three episodes of the trilogy of Ace Attorney before, uh, what is it, like, September, I think it comes out? Or something like that. It comes out <laughs> in, like, a couple months. So it's like, I don't even think I could, like, beat the first game in time for when that comes out so i'm gonna take my time with that and thankfully you guys are also kind of on board with that i guess maybe a lot of people are playing it because of that reason or it's just it's a classic a lot of people have already seen it uh and a lot of you wanted to watch duck detective which i thought was interesting because i have yet to see anything from that game i've stayed blind to it uh, because I knew I wanted to play it on the channel at some point. So I'm really excited to play that. Especially if you guys are excited. That makes me more excited because I'm like, okay, it must be good. <laughs> um, I have stayed blind to later alligator as well. So I'm curious about that. And Dark Side Detective, I've played the first game before, but there's a sequel that I haven't played. And I think the sequel is like twice as long as the first game. So I was like, okay, people must have liked it. I don't like this. I could tell you that much. I kind of want to... Ooh. I should have stayed in that hotel. Oh, dear. I do have pasta. Ten and five. How we looking? I should hold on to that pasta. But you know what we finna do? We finna be smart, y'all. Come play some peeky boo. Yeah, you didn't see anything. Oh, <laughs> that's <laughs> it's cool how they just disappear. I'm like terrified though. <laughs> okay, little too close for comfort. Can I just run? That might be my best bet. Just run. Just run. Just run. You good. You good. We Gucci. <laughs> Your star power is now seven. And now Mario can use the special attack. Showstopper. Hey. Mario found the sixth crystal star hidden craftily in the Poshly Heights sanctum. Now, only one crystal star remains. But our hero still does not know where Princess Peach is being held. Where could the last crystal star be? 
And where is Princess Peach being held? Hoping this crystal star might yield answers, Mario and friends return to Pennington. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh god, I still have to get out of here. Uh, I kind of want to tattle on one of them though, but I feel like they're going to be crazy hard. And I might die. <laughs> and I'm not here for that. <laughs> but, um, yeah. I, uh, I don't know much. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> hmm. So that is where it was. Er, nothing. Nothing. Just talking to my brain. <laughs> All geniuses do it. I like that. I'm not talking to myself. I'm talking to my brain. <laughs> Congratulations, Luigi. You have found the real crystal star. So please, feel free to take it. I will just put another fake one over here. <laughs> well, traveling with you has been rather hectic, but I do admit, rather fun as well. I'm sure you still have a long road ahead, Luigi, but do not give up. Thank you, Pennington. That was really nice. Can I go through that window? <laughs> no, okay. That's just too funny to me. But I've got like a list of Mr. Games that I want to play and I'm real excited y'all. Y'all don't understand like I feel like that's also something that's like missing in like the Let's Play community. Uh, maybe I'm just not aware but I only know of like one person who plays like mystery games specifically like uh, Gab Smulders, uh, Jacksepticeye's wife I think? Girlfriend or wife? Something like that. <laughs> But, um, she plays a lot of Nancy Drew games, which I love me some Nancy Drew. I've only played games for the DS, though, for. I haven't actually played, like, the computer games. Um, and I've seen, like, one or two TikTok streamers who play, like, mystery horror games. And, uh, we gotta fill that gap, you know? There's, there's a missing, a missing niche there. <laughs> What is the matter with you idiots? Falling for a fake crystal star? That's asinine. <laughs> Sorry, dude. I, I mean, sir. <laughs> so let me guess. This means Mario managed to get this real crystal star. Uh, I'm gonna say maybe. I like this dude. <laughs> uh, this mustache menace has nearly every crystal star now. They were mine. I think I'd better alter my plan a bit. Before you do, Sir Grotus, I think I'd better tell you something. What is it, fool? Mumble, mumble. <laughs> what? Are you sure? Speak. No joke, dude. I mean, affirmative, sir, dude. Uh, uh, that is, I'm positive, sir. <sighs> Treason. Mutiny. <laughs> Strange, isn't it about time for Tech to call me in? Maybe he's busy. She is too happy. <laughs> Tell you, Princess Peach be getting kidnapped on purpose. Oh, here we go. She is ready, y'all. She's like, let's go. Gotta find my kidnapper. <laughs> Goodness. Hello, Tech. What do you want today? Good. Princess Peach, I have... I have reached a conclusion. <laughs> a conclusion? I have struggled with whether to obey orders or to speak to you, and I cannot confirm what I should believe. Tech, you don't sound right. What's going on with you? Princess Peach, please escape from this place as quickly as possible. Escape? Tech? What do you mean by that? I mean, why all of a sudden? The data you procure has been analyzed and something terrible is... No, I will not say, but I have found out everything about Sir Grotus' plans. Grotus' plans? You mean about conquering the world? Yes, and among those plans was the reason why you are being held here, according to the data. Uh? Oh, okay, we just don't hear it. I see, I see. No, no, it's impossible.
possible. I, I don't believe it. Yes, everything is true. That is why you must escape from here as fast as possible. But how can I do that, Tech? I mean, I don't even have the slightest idea where I am. I will not hide anything anymore. Not, not, <laughs> no, not from you. I will tell you everything. The place where you are currently imprisoned. This is the moon. <laughs> the moon? <laughs> you mean the moon that hangs up in the sky at night? That moon? <laughs> that is correct. But that's unbelievable. How in the world am I supposed to escape? There is a way. You can escape, but you must follow my instructions exactly. But, Ted, don't they know that you helped me? Won't you get in trouble? That is inquant inconsequential. What is with this dialogue, y'all? Please tell me they simplified it in the remake. <laughs> I would like you to be safe. That is all that matters. I am the base's computer. No one will know of your escape if I keep silent. Please do not worry about me. Escape. Escape as quickly as possible. Uh, okay, Tech. But I, I must inform Mario about all this before I go. This is no longer just my problem. Understood. To the moon. I wonder if I hold it that she can, like, get more of the message across. <laughs> hold it right there, Princess Peach. Yeah, I thought it was probably a bad idea to be sending out messages. Like, even if Tech didn't say anything, you just look in your emails and you're like, huh, oh, there's a lot of messages going to this one number that I don't have saved. <laughs> Tech, you miserable machine. We all know what you're up to, traitor. Sir Grotus, I... In my most paranoid moments, I never thought my own computer would betray me. Well, it doesn't really matter in the end, I suppose. Especially since it ends here. You monster! What are you planning to do with him? Yak, yak, yak. <laughs> what is that laugh? Only one thing to do with a malfunctioning computer. Cut the circuit and delete all the programs and data that caused the malfunction. Obviously, all data relating to Princess Peach must go as well. Yes, we must be absolutely sure nothing like this ever happens again. No, I am... I am normal. There is no malfunction. Pipe down, Tech. x not at the same time. Press the red buttons on Tech's side. Got it, sir. Doing a hard reset. <laughs> Factory reset. <laughs> I, no. Mail sent. Princess Peach. I. I. Oh, L. Oh, aww. That's so sweet. It's a computer, though. It's like AI telling you it loves you. I'm like, uh, but do you really? But do you? Oh, this is just sad to watch. Just let it be over, y'all. <laughs> Deletion complete. Dang. Tech. Yak, 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 yak. Too bad Princess Peach Tech is no longer with us. Honestly, you care a little too much about a computer. He was honestly probably doing you a favor because you was getting a little... little poo -poo for Cocoa Puffs. <laughs> Her face. <laughs> no. You inhuman beast. How could you? Did you forget what you were going up against, girl? <laughs> Princess Peach, just stop it. This is no time to be worrying about a computer. <laughs> Someone said it. Oh, he has some very important things for you to do now. Yes, very important. No. Jack, jack, jack. <laughs> I cannot. Yeah, your progress was safe. Bruh. It's getting real. It's going down on the moon. Meet me at the moon. It's going down. Oh yeah, Bowser! Oh, <laughs> <Aww. laughs> that was the one dude that's just like bagging into the alley. 
<laughs> when you feel safer in the alley than on the main street, that's when you know you in a rough spot. <laughs> Ugh, blah. I've got no crystal stars. Can't find Princess Peach. Twilight Town was, well, wasn't exactly glorious. What's going on here? If this keeps up, Mario's gonna steal everything from my grasps. As usual. Aww. Your massiveness! <laughs> Speaking of massive, I want that, uh... What's in that chest over there? <laughs> we did it! The Magic Koopa Scouts found a suspicious underground chamber. It isn't even on any maps. Yeah, really suspicious. Something must be there. Hmm. About time. Well done. This is where it all turns around for me. Definitely. The Hammer Bros Battalion is attempting to breach the chamber at the moment. The area is impenetrable. They're scraping tooth and nail in there. No problem. Direct me there. I'll blast us through. I'm Bowser, baby. <laughs> Are we about to, like, do another fight sequence? <laughs> what did I miss? <laughs> oh, well, you were lost, bro. Yeah! Uh, hex, yeah, let's do this. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, okay, this is a little difficult. I just love this. It's so dang cute. I would love to see this, these sections and like the new style. Especially since this is where it'd be appropriate for everything to be crazy dark. Give me that. Oh god, oh god. Oh, that's a bull, bruh. Oh, I can't even go that. Oh no, <laughs> bruh, that is some bull, y'all. And I'm talking about bouillon. Oh, do I get me? Oh, are you kidding me? What is my look, bruh? <laughs> I can't. I are you kidding me? I. F what am I supposed to do? There we go. Bruh, this is some bull. I missed out on so much. <laughs> no! <laughs> Dang. That's sad, y'all. That's sad. <sighs> oh well, I finished. <laughs> Do you even lift, bro? <laughs> Incredible Lord Bowser, nothing stood in your way. Everything stood in my way. <laughs> you couldn't be more super. Please, no problem. I felt right at home, but where are we now? Gracious me, look, Lord Bowser, on the wall behind you. Oh. Hello. Could it be? Aw, oh, yeah, Crystal Star. Advantage Bowser. <laughs> At last, we found one, and now we'll make it ours. Freeze, chumps. Huh? <laughs> uh? <laughs> Grah, who's there? <laughs> don't tell me you don't know the famous Rock Hawk. You little punk weasel. You forget these muscles. You forget this hugeness. Don't ask me how, but you cleared my secret training facility. Not too shabby. I even imported some super freaks to up the difficulty level. You're good. Of course, good don't count for squatting this biz, babe. My champ's belt is mine. Crar <laughs> Oh, look. What an adorable little weakling. Hi, fella. Weak? Wait, what? Well, tell me something. You ever see a weakling do this? <laughs> pain. <laughs> Just pain. Ouch. <laughs> no way you're sleeping. I knew you were a weakling. Er? <laughs> what? The crystal star? Huh? Eek! It's splitting too. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, oh no, oh no, no. <laughs> Wait. Hold the phone. My mighty Lord Bowser, this is just glass. It's a flip flam. A fake. What? 
Speak English. <laughs> you all want the real one. The greater Gonzalez has it. Oh, my aching hair. <laughs> Feel the rock. <laughs> I don't know anyone named Gonzalez. Stop speaking in riddles, you chicken nugget. <laughs> Crud. Who would I have to flatten to get a crystal star? Who? Who? Oh. <laughs> oh, he could help me out in the rain. They both were there. <sighs> Goodness. <laughs> we are here. Home sweet home. Gosh, that chapter feels so much shorter than it did when I was younger. Jesus. Mario, that sounds like an email from Princess Peach. Not a good one. Mario, I know where I'm being held. I'm on the moon. Yes, the moon that floats out in space. And I've learned something even more horrifying. In order to resurrect the monster spirit, they need my... The moon? That's totally nuts. Princess Peach is on the moon? I mean, that actually sounds pretty cool, but why is her email cut off? Oh my gosh, you don't think something happened to her, do you? That's exactly what happened. <laughs> oh, what happened to him? Well, guess what I found in Roadport Root? Rapturous ruins, bro. Yup, a marvelous compass piece. This part of my adventure was actually sort of sad, if you want to know the truth. It was pretty insane, bro. When I hear what happened, it's a pretty long story. Hey, sounds good to me. Which part of my story you want to hear, bro? If you want to hear what I've been up to, just come find me, okay? I'll be around. I'll, I'll read those out one of these days, but not today. <laughs> we go into the moon. God. I might play that. It was It's a good story for anyone who hasn't seen it, but it's also very sad. Um, I guess so worth it, though. <laughs> Great, great story though. Mm -hmm. 